In this tutorial, you'll learn how to create the sunburst effect in Flash. The first thing you need to do is open up a new Flash document. We're going to select a new line tool. Create a line which is a little bit larger than your stage. You want to select a line and align it to its center point vertically and horizontally. Make sure two stage is selected in the align palette. Now with this, we'll copy it, we will paste in place, and we want to we will open up the transform and we want to rotate this 90 degrees. 90 degrees. So now we have a cross platform going on. We'll double click the stroke so we can select both of them copy them, paste them again, press Q or select the free transform free transform tool and we can rotate it freely till it makes this star look. And we will copy it again and paste in place and we can rotate it but it snaps onto the nearest angle and we don't want that. So I found that rotating it about 25, 22 degrees it gives it a pretty centered look and you can actually go into making more by just copy pasting in place and rotating it to your pleasure. Alright, that's a lot you can see how that looks and how it comes out. The reason why we keep it a why we've made this a little longer is you can see on the outer on the perimeter of our shape it's a circle formation. So we can um, create a oval and put a circle all around it. So if we did want it to rotate it'd be really easy. Um, for this I'm gonna take out the fill. I only want a stroke. So I'm gonna go select the fill and hit the no color so you see a red line through it. I'm going to go from the center, press Alt and Shift so I get a pretty nice circle. As I'm not doing this perfect, you can center it. I just did it on the on the fly. I recommend that you center it, but okay. Next part part of this process is coloring the the strokes, any color that you want, in alternating order. So I'm going to go with a red and yellow. Uh, select the uh, paint bucket tool and just go to work. With your entire circle filled with alternating colors, you can see the sunburst effect. Um, what I want to do now is press Control A, which selects all. I'm going to go to the stroke color, and I'm going to go over here to the no color, which removes every single stroke that was created in our document. I'm going to test the movie to see how this looks. It's a really cool burst effect. You can export this image and use it for background in, in some other program or your website or whatever. Uh, we're going to take this another step. We're going to hit Control A again, press F8, which will convert to symbol and will convert it to a movie clip. I'll call it Sun. And I will press OK. I'll give it an inst uh In fact, I'll just use a tween. So I'll go from the first frame to frame 20, F6, to create a new frame. And I will select the frame prior and change the tween to a motion tween. And I'll bring the properties up a little bit so I can get the other options. 
I want it to rotate. Oh, wow, there's an error. Clockwise. So let's test the movie now. You can see that cool clockwise rotating. I mean, the frame rate is not so fast, but if you put it up to the proper frame rate, then you'll have a really nice effect. And you can also use Action Skip to create this effect to. Uh, this is worth. If you like these tutorials, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Show your support by rating and commenting on my videos. Also, go to my website, onenterflash.blogspot.com. Thanks for watching. On Enter Flash.